Also, when you're at a festival, sometimes you have to make some sacrifices. You got to make decisions. And maybe you got to get there a little earlier. You might have to stand a little long. Like, there are certain things and concessions you're going to have to make. And if you've never been to a festival, maybe you're not aware of what that's going to come with. If you think you can just come pull up a chair and sit somewhere and watch all your favorite performers, like, that's just not reality if you want to get close. If you want a comfortable seat, you can stand a couple hundred feet back and watch them in a massive screen. Um, but yeah, I just thought from what I saw, uh, when you get when you partner with Cisco, UPS, and Google, like that tells me what you're working with. Um, excuse me. So I just I don't know. I, I get some of the outrage, but I think there was a lot of good that's being overshadowed and not being discussed enough. And I think that's a disservice and it kind of sucks because Pharrell seems like a dope person that wanted to put on a good event for the people bringing out, like you said, he, he could have ignored, you know, DC. They incorporated Go-Go. They mm -hmm. didn't shy away from Go-Go. They had a whole experience with Go-Go and a conversation on its history. Like they leaned into um a, a lot of the history and the culture there and he, they spoke all the, a number of the artists spoke to it um and so I, I just feel like a lot of that's being under discussed and i get it you know there, there was one issue and for a lot of people that was a big issue but for me i had a blast i i saw a bunch of people i had never seen i saw a bunch of people i wanted to see did i miss some people yes but the great news is there's other festivals. So when you got to make a decision, go to another festival. Like you got to pick and choose sometimes.